guys, it's Rachel here. Um, I'm going to actually uh, read another quote from my novel, The Soldier and the Stripper. And I would, I would just want to say thank you to everyone who's been reading it, who's been supporting me, all my family and friends, um, and everyone, strangers and people on YouTube and all that stuff. Because of you, and only because of you, I started off this process, and the numbers were at 212. And now, because of you, it's at 357. So that's all because of you. That doesn't have anything to do with me. That's all because of you. And I'm well on my way to that 500 um, uh, reads goal. So, thank you so much, and as usual, I will put the l link it, um, link it link in the description box where you can find my novel. So, just look in the description box and you'll find uh, where to read my novel for free online. Okay, so this quote comes uh, when there's a tra tragedy in the life of Florence and Clayton, and this this um, this quote comes uh, after the tragedy um, without giving too much away. Let's just say. Florence has had an issue with her mother um, since the day she was born. Her and her mother don't see things eye to eye. So uh, when this thing happens, it kind of shakes the family with Florence and her mother and Clayton and his father. And for more on those relationships, you'll have to read the book. Um, but... Here is a quote when she's talking to her mother and the mother says this. Her mother says, It's funny how tra how tragedy sometimes is what a person needs to give them a push. To give them the push to wake up and realize that it's not what you have or who you hang out with that, that matters. It's who you are inside, your character, the essence of your being. That's what's really important. And that's the end of that quote. Um, and then you'll, you'll see um, through the novel why that quote is so pivotal. Um, it comes near the end of the book when Florence's mother has kind of um, done a complete turnaround um, from who she was before. Um, she was a very... Um, she was a person really... A rich person who was really... Um, into appearances and how they would look to other people and she really didn't uh, value her daughter or take her daughter into account and that caused Florence to go through some stuff about herself and and things like that so um, it is really a phenomenal turnaround not only from Florence and Clayton but from 
Florence's mother and Clayton's father. It's uh, the book shows how God turns their lives around too. Um, so I pray that you read the book and love it and enjoy it and feel feel free. I haven't said this in any of the other videos, which I should have. Feel free to pass it on to whoever you think will enjoy it. And it's so, it was a pleasure writing it, writing it, and it's even more of a pleasure now that people are reading it. It's amazing when you write something, you're not sure of how people will be reading it. And the response to this, uh, has been amazing and I'm so grateful and so happy. Um, I'll see you guys later. Okay, have a good Thursday. Bye.